Now, the Student Representative Council of the Ghana School of Law has called out the Attorney General, Godfrey Ibo Adame, and members of Parliament over what they describe as unfairness meted out to some students who passed the law school entrance exam but have been denied admission. Addressing the news conference on the development, SRC President Wanda Victor Kuto said it appears Parliament may have tied the hands of the General Legal Council. This matter is of national interest, and we hereby call on the Attorney General to state its position on this matter. We call on the majority group, the minority group in Parliament, to state their position in this matter. We call on the Parliamentary Subcommittee on, on Education to state their position on this matter. I will let you know why. Earlier this year, the Ministry of Finance submitted its budget. Submitted its budget to the submitted his budget to Parliament and I must say that the budget they propose that law school admission for this year should be within 500 thereabouts. That was the proposal by the Minister of Finance. We are reliably informed that it was the Parliamentary Subcommittee on Education that pushed for the number to move around 700 thereabouts. So on the face of it, on the face of it, it does appear there's a numbers game here. Is it the case that Parliament have tied the hands of the General Legal Council that they should only admit students within the 790, and which is why they are not able to admit more? So we are calling on Parliament to state their position on this matter.